So, it looks like Verizon accidentally, and emphasis on accidentally, buys $1.5 million worth of 2.5 gigahertz spectrum. Now, I was very shocked when I read when I heard about this. I didn't expect Verizon to come in at all and just and to, to not buy anything because people were saying AT&T and Verizon were not going to participate because they don't really need the 2.5 gigahertz spectrum because they're working on their own 5G network and they have enough money to invest. Even though 5G is, you know, the build up for 5G is going to take a while. And I also heard rumors. I'm not going to say who said this because I want to keep um, their identity, uh, you know, in private. But they said there was, um, I think it's, I don't know, I, th I think it's a rumor, but it's what he heard his uh, in his perspective. He heard that if Verizon or AT&T were to buy a lot and i'm not, and i'm not, i'm not saying 1.5 million dollars of 2.5 uh, gigahertz spectrum is a lot it is a lot of money but if verizon decided to buy the, to buy the whole pie of what t-mobile bought or buy even half of that like even 60 percent or if at&t decided to buy it they would be slammed with fines over 100 million dollars around 100 to 500 million dollars in fines and i find that kind of crazy that these that these billion dollar tech uh, uh, telecom companies would be sued because I don't know if it's like a, if it's something T-Mobile needs because back ten years ago um, T-Mobile was a small carrier they weren't as big as Verizon AT and T but now they're a little bigger and I can see why and if you scroll down to the article here this is basically where they bought the spectrum now they didn't buy it in a lot of areas you can see. Um, what I'll do is uh, I'll actually, this link, I'll put this link in my description so you guys can check it out. So you can see here, they bought some in Arizona, Oklahoma, Illinois, where, as you can see, they bought it, um, kind of close to where Toronto is, um, Chicago, uh, Atlanta, New York, uh, close to Texas. And like I said, it's not a lot, but. I'm just wondering what Verizon is going to do with this. Um, they really can't do much for it. It's about 100 megahertz. Now, don't get me wrong. 100 megahertz is not like... I'm not saying it's a lot. 100 megahertz is good. It's good amount of uh, chunk of spectrum to use for anything. But I don't know what Verizon is going to do with this. Maybe they'll convert it to some... Maybe they they maybe they have something up their sleeve that we don't know. They, they might convert it to... I don't know. I honestly can't say because I don't want to be wrong on this and just give out wrong information. But they could hold it up and sell it to T-Mobile later for more money if if it actually has value. Like let's say the this spectrum that Verizon bought with of um on one point five million dollars. Let's say they convert it to like really fast five G. I mean, it's like I said, it's not a lot, but let's say they convert it to something kind of crazy. I'm just speculating here. And it's good. It's good uses. It's, like I said, it's not in a lot of areas, but let's say T-Mobile wants this, which will complete ninety eight percent of what they bought. And let's say, um, let's say I don't know. Verizon says, "Oh, you want this now that we made it better, or that this is more more than what it used to be." Or they might, "Oh, we want two billion for this, eleven, twelve billion, which I think is crazy, but." Like I said, I don't know what Verizon's plan with this. They might keep it. They might convert it to 5G. They might convert it to, I don't know, whatever spectrum they need to use for this. But I, <laughs> this is a confusing, this is confusing times for tem for communication companies like this just be doing this. I don't know if Verizon's just fumbling or I don't know what they're doing. But what do you guys think about this? I think Mar Verizon might have a strategy or Verizon might is just doing this just because they want to sell it back to them. Honestly, don't know what the end game is for this. Maybe Verizon can, I don't know. I don't know what they'll do. I'm trying to figure it out here. I'm trying to put two and two together. I'm not sure. I'm not sure how long they'll be keeping this spectrum though. I'm very curious to see how this will play. If they will hold this off or if they'll convert it to something. I'm not too sure. But what do you guys think about this? Let me know what you guys think about this. Hope you guys enjoy this video. Subscribe for more videos like this, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.